Felix, my goodness, I swear you're always draining. Such a hard worker, so strong. Hello? Felix? What? You can hear me. That's good. I was worried maybe your ears didn't work. What do you want? Oh, nothing. Nothing in particular, I mean. But now that I'm here, and now that you've asked, when you've finished up, do you think you'd like to join me in the dining hall for something sweet? I'll pass. I don't like sweets. Also, you're a nuisance. Stay away from me. That's not a very nice way to talk to a classmate. Anyway, you sound like you're shooing away a stray cat. Shh, shut up. I am not a stray cat, Felix, and I am not leaving until you take a moment to chat with me. Ah, <sighs> you are a pest. Fine, do what you will. Oh, you better believe I am going to keep doing exactly what I will. Hmm, maybe instead of a sweet treat, we can get something spicy. Would you like that? I've heard the dining hall is serving a dish with some western spices in it. Mmm. Does that sound good, Felix? Would you like something spicy instead of sweet? You're distracting me. When I am hungry, I will eat. Alone. Stop squawking at me. <laughs> well, since you asked so nicely, I'll leave you in peace. Goodbye, Felix. Finally. You're following me. Stop. I am leaving you alone, just as you asked. I may be walking the same way as you, but... What do you want? You've made it abundantly clear I'm not to want anything from you, including politeness. I heard a rumor that you're planning to settle down with a noble. You're trying to get close to me, aren't you? You want to marry into House Fraldarius. Nice try, Felix, but it's not like any old noble will do. I just find you interesting is all. Is that so odd? Interesting? I'm not interesting. What do you mean? I've never met a noble so... unsociable. Yes, that's the word, unsociable. Other nobles are quick to be friends, even if it's just because they might gain something from it. The Empire's nobility, maybe. The Kingdom's nobility is a whole different animal. If they are, so what? You should care how others think of you. Why? I don't answer to them. All that matters is improving my skill. I'll prove my worth on the battlefield. Those people care so much about appearances, they can't even see each other. It makes me sick. Oh, I agree. What's important isn't how someone looks, it's their true nature. I don't pretend to know your true nature. I don't even have a very good understanding of my own. But I suppose you see mine just fine, don't you? Just a silly girl with no thoughts in her head except for marrying a noble. Yes? <laughs> Goodbye, Felix. Hmm. You, get over here. Get over here? <laughs> How about I tell you to get out of here? You're always following me around. At least make yourself useful. Let's spar. What? Are you serious? I don't joke. Draw your weapon, unless you intend to fight without one. If you want to train, then do it on your own. If you don't attack first, I will. Okay. If you want me to knock some sense into you, who am I to say no? For someone whose only aspiration is marriage, you're pretty strong. <laughs> is this your attempt at flattery? Oh, it is, isn't it? When I was in the opera, I always trained for self-defense. Couldn't really get by without it. Nowadays, if you can't use a sword, then you're just in the way. Perhaps I had you all wrong. I thought you were just a frivolous girl who cared only for men of status. 
On the contrary, you seem well aware of the realities of the world. I respect that. Yeah, yeah, all right. Ah, <sighs> I'm beat. I'm going to go sit down and relax with a cup of tea. You'll join me, naturally. I will? We just trained together. Are you really going to turn me down? <sighs> just this once. Good. Let's go for tea. While we're at it, shall you treat me to a meal? Don't get carried away. No, oh, you're no fun. So, Felix, is the tea to your liking? It is. It's nice to relax like this every now and then, isn't it? It is. You said some of your equipment is damaged, didn't you? It... it is. Are you not in the mood to talk? We could discuss your family or what's happening in high society. Flavors of tea? Your favorite jokes? None of those. I already told you, I don't joke. <sighs> of course, only cynicism. <sighs> oh, I know. We're holding a small opera in the cathedral soon. I'll be singing too. If you're interested in... Uh, but of course you aren't. You can sing? I'm sorry. What did you just say? Can I sing? I was only a diva of the Middle Front Opera Company, that's all. Oh, right. I forgot. You forgot? Am I that uninteresting to you? <sighs> what must you think of me? You're insincere and loud, is what I think. But you do make a good sparring partner. And a good tea companion. Oh. Anyway, when's the concert? It's an opera, and you don't have to come. You just invited me. You can't tell me not to come. That's for me to decide. Oh, then you must be there. I'll sing my heart out just for you. I haven't said I'll go. Are you going to come or not? If you keep teasing me, I might just pretend to cry. Fine, I'll go. Fantastic! I look forward to it. <laughs> <laughs>